Hi, this is Rob with Quilting on a Budget, and today we're going to make a pressing stick for our piecing work. And we're going to take approximately a one foot long, 12 inches or 30 centimeters uh, piece of half round, and we're cutting four layers of batting to fit around the half round molding. Going to put a little bit of glue to hold the batting in place while we finish the project. And I'm using Elmer's glue stick, which is a water-soluble, easy-to-obtain glue. And we're going to place the batting, center it on the wood dowel, and now we're going to place two layers, I'm using a cotton fabric with a cotton batting over the edge of the stick and again going to add a little glue to the back of the fabric to hold it in place until it's secured permanently. Now we place it in the middle, press it down smoothly. And now we're going to turn our project upside down. Fold our edges over and I'm going to use a staple gun to hold the fabric in place. And you want this tight, but you don't want it too tight. You want it to have some bounce and some loft for when you press your seams. And this is used for pressing your seams open by your machine. And there we have a finished pressing stick. And thank you for watching this video. If you would like to see more videos like this, please subscribe to our channel. This is Rob with Quilting on a Budget.